everyone, it's Gina with Dancing Daisy Designs, and today I have another product release for you. DIY Paint has released three brand new cottage colors. And if you haven't already heard about the cottage color paints, then you are missing out. This paint is amazing. It's been around for about a year now, and it's a little different formula than the clay-based paint. This paint is an all-in-one paint, so it has a built-in top coat. That means that after you paint something, you don't have to seal it. It's already ready to go, done and sealed. And in addition to that, this paint is all natural, it has no VOCs. That means you can use it in your house, around your children, your pets. It's not gonna have any weird fumes or any of that yucky stuff in it. So this paint is super amazing. It's also self-leveling, which I find to be really awesome, especially with something with a built-in top coat, because you're gonna get that nice level finish and it's gonna look really kind of a factory kind of finish. And I think that is a big plus. And then if that wasn't already enough, it's also rated for outdoor use. So you can paint something that you're gonna be putting outside in the weather and it's going to be weather resistant. And so, I mean, how amazing is that? This paint has got it all. And now there are eight amazing colors and I'm gonna go ahead and drop in and show you every single one of those eight amazing colors starting with the three brand new colors right now. The first new color is called Crockery and this is a beautiful neutral light brown color and it was actually color matched from a vintage crock, thus the name Crockery. So that's exactly the color you're going to be getting with this one. The next color is called Americana and this color is based on uh, the color of like a beautiful green chicken egg and um, it's from the Americana chicken, apparently lays these beautiful green eggs. And to me, this color feels kind of like a like in between um, apothecary and mint chip. So it's a little brighter than apothecary, but not as bright as mint chip. It is gorgeous. I can't wait to play with this color. The next color is called Blue Hills, and Blue Hills is a brighter blue. I kind of feel like it's like got some farm fresh feel to it, but a little bit brighter. So it's come up like a step in the brightness. And I really like this color so much. It's that powdery light blue, but it's got the brightness in it. So it's gorgeous. And um, those are the three brand new colors. So what do you guys think of the three new colors? Do you love them? Which one is your favorite? Comment down below and let me know. Now I want to show you the other five colors in this paint line. The first color is called Vintage Pink, and this is the most gorgeous pale pink that you will ever see. And of course, it is based on a vintage pink. The next color is also just as gorgeous, and it is called Vintage Mint. This color is based on like that beautiful minty light green that you saw everywhere um, back in like, what was it, the 50s? Beautiful, beautiful green. And then of course, you can't have a line without having a beautiful white. And this is a nice, bright, pure white. Um, this white is, I find it perfect for all of my projects. This is like, a must have, definitely. Next we have Haint Blue, and this is a beautiful light smoky blue. I love this color so much. It is actually the color, I guess in the south, people will paint the ceiling of their porch with this blue color because it looks like the sky and it's supposed to repel insects from landing on the ceiling and leaving a mess. So. Gorgeous color. Um, next we have gray skies, and gray skies is just like a like a darker gray color. I find it to be more of a medium gray. Um, in my opinion, this um, picture is a little darker than the actual color comes out when you use it, but it is gorgeous. I love that they put a gray in there because I like my grays. 
So what do you think about those colors? Aren't they nice? They've got like a nice, like more of a neutral line going here. They're starting to add some more pops of colors with the newer colors. And um, let me know down in the comments below which color is your favorite. And if you've tried this paint before, let me know what you thought about it. I absolutely love this paint. It is so good. And if you need to try it, you can find all of these colors and more at dancingdaisydesigns.com or you can shop locally at Eclectic Curio or Antique World Mall. And I do this for a living, you guys. So this is my full-time job. And so um, people like you make it possible for me to keep doing this. And so I really love and appreciate every single one of you. Thank you for watching my video. If you like this content, please make sure you're subscribed. That helps me out so much. And um, if you already subscribed, thank you. Make sure to share with your friends. And I have a video coming out where I'm actually gonna be painting this piece of furniture for outdoor use using one of the new colors. So make sure to check out that video. And I will see you in the next video. Bye for now.